Hello everyone, welcome to this video session. In this video session, we shall add map. So let's get back to our work site. We shall add map. Let's look for something we've not used. Page we've not used. We've used map work, but we've not used assignments. Okay. So I mean you can rename this as map you can always rename it yeah this is just uh, to get you started so what we have to do here we just hold onto map we hold on it we yeah, we click we hold and we drag okay and here it says San Francisco okay when you point when you click on it that's San Francisco California you want to change this address of course I want to change it I want to change it to Montgomery Alabama okay and I when I do that I click that so this is on Montgomery Alabama and it kind of shows you where you know this is kind of like a map that you would kind of you know you would want to have if sometimes you if you want it on your side now uh, you can look at this later on you can check the width the height you can change all these the position where you want it to be positioned the spacing if you know the latitude and longitude of the city you are if you know the latitude and longitude the exact latitude and longitude you can put in the values here okay and you can kind of uh, play with all these if you want to show scale you will check yes if you want to display overview map you will click yes so you can kind of you know play with it yeah that's the way you add maps now another thing I want to talk about before I now go to the next video that will summarize uh, what we have learned so far uh, is the math quizzes the math quizzes math quizzes okay in this math quizzes I would like to direct you there's a to the video I made last year when I was doing this workshop last year yes I did this workshop last year uh, that was with the old Weebly but there are some differences between the old Weebly and the new Weebly uh, it's not much difference anyway well there are some different that's there's there's some difference but not so much not so much difference I mean if you if you learn how to use the old Weebly then you can also use the new Weebly uh, and where can you see those videos good you go to my website of course when you click on my picture to enter uh, you click on presentations and when you come to presentations under videos you click here create your website free with Weebly now this is the this is the uh, video I did last year and for the online quizzes is this so add online quizzes so I want you to view this video yeah business I want you to view the vi view this video there is a specific website I talked about which is thatquiz.org thatquiz.org is is a pretty good site thatquiz.org yeah it's a nice website that I recommend for every teacher I mean every teacher yeah now they did not pay me to advertise it but it is good it is a good website I recommend for every teacher now uh you can look at it okay you can kind of look at it and i talked about it on that video so you will you will see how to 
you will know how to add uh, online quizzes online quizzes but in any case you would you usually what i do mine for my online quizzes this was the way i did it when i was teaching at south lawn uh, my former website i had this and when i click on test Test. I had your online test goes from that quiz. Your online test goes from that quiz. And this was the way I did it, you know, like on the 29th of March, this was the test they were going to take. On the 31st of March, this was the test that we are going to take and this is the code this is the code on for the first period for the second period so i kind of did it this way you know so the students know when they come to class already and it's a test day okay or even when they're at home they will go to it and i kind of saved this i saved it and i i linked it that's i attached I attached this file as I linked it to this file I linked it to this file I linked it to read so look at that video look at the video I did last year and it will show you how to add online quizzes okay thank you so much for listening and don't forget to do what to publish because we added a map don't forget to publish and if you want to look at it you click or you refresh but we just clicked straight on uh, mad documents smart work I think we did it under assignments and this is our map okay thank you for listening <music>